Laugh out loud, love a lot, and shop for what makes you happy. Hey guys, Mandy here with Laugh Love Shop. If this is your first time joining me, welcome. This is a lifestyle channel, so on top of fashion and beauty videos like this, I also do DIYs, home decor, all kinds of things, so I hope you'll click subscribe and stick around for a while. Share this channel with your friends and help a girl out. If you feel so inclined, you can hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on the fun. And as always, feel free to watch the videos that interest you and skip the ones that don't. And today, I'm going to be teaching you how to find your face shape. So let's get started. Overall, there are seven different face shapes. So let's talk about each one of them. The first is an oval face shape, which as you can imagine, is shaped like an oval. For example, the lovely Megan Fox has an oval face shape. Now, technically speaking, the ratio of width by length of your face is going to be one to one and a half. No human is perfect, but it'll be about there. Now let's talk about the round face shape, which is, you guessed it, round. But hear me on this. This does not mean a person who is overweight. It just means that the ratio of their face is about one to one. The stunning Selena Gomez has a round face. The next several face shapes have more to do with the width of your forehead to cheekbone to jawline than they do length to width. For example, a heart-shaped face, like the lovely Scarlett Johansson. She has a broader forehead, her cheekbones are about the same width, and then she has a very narrow jawline with a little pointed chin. Next up is a diamond face shape, and Halle Berry is our example here. She has a more narrow forehead, wider cheekbones, and a narrow chin, making the diamond shape. Next, let's talk about the square face shape. And Lucy Liu is a great example of this, and they have broad, jaw lines about the same width for their cheekbones and broad forehead so pretty much straight down and not a whole lot of chin two more face shapes to go the first is the triangle face shape so just like a square face shape they're gonna have a heavy jaw but unlike the square face shape they're gonna have a narrow forehead and then their cheekbones are gonna be somewhere in the middle a great example of this is Ali Larder she's the first person that I think of I hope I'm pronouncing her name right but she has the perfect example of a triangle face and the last face shape is an oblong face shape for this example I've chosen Liv Tyler I myself am also a long face shape person and an oblong face shape can be really any shape except the round it can be oval that's oblong. It could be an oblong heart. It could be um, an oblong square, I guess making it a rectangle. But really the proportions are technically speaking a ratio of 1 to 1.6 or greater. Now that you know what the basic face shapes are, are the best thing that you can do is look in a mirror with your hair back preferably like in a ponytail so you can't even see it or if you have a picture of yourself where your hair is back and you happen to be looking directly at the camera good luck with that then you could use that also so looking in the mirror imagine a line going down the center of your face also imagine lines across your forehead cheekbones and jawbone and see where they're at now like i said we're all human beings, so none of us are gonna be exactly perfectly into one box, and sometimes it takes a little bit of trial and error. In a couple weeks, I'll be having a video on the best hat for your face shape. So a great way you can do that is to see what kind of hat works well on you and work your way backwards. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up to let YouTube know this is the kind of video you would like to see more of, and I will talk to you next time. Bye. New videos every Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. In the meantime, check these out and follow me across social media.